Let the games begin. Two, one. Pass by left lane number one ahead is your target. Right number one in front of you. It's not what you'd expect to see state police climb into heading out on patrol. The public believes that the police is not paying attention or aren't present. You get to see a lot of the aggressive driving. You'll see drivers uh, passing on the shoulder. You'll see the texting and uh, cell phone use. From their higher vantage point, troopers are able to spot distracted drivers. Texting right here. Honestly, if you woke up this morning and there's a lot of highway patrol everywhere surrounded around you at the rest areas, at the way stations, on the side of the road, you know, then you are a part of this six state trooper project that's going on. It's something that started last year and it was successful to educate truck drivers. So they're doing it once again. So if you're in Indiana, Ohio, Michigan, West Virginia, Kentucky, or Pennsylvania, then they're going to educate your ass. That's for damn sure. So even though they're just going to use the American people's tax money uh, to pull you over in an airplane, semi-truck, car, submarine, yacht, whatever the heck it is to pull you over, they just want to educate you. That's it. Because they even say here, every traffic stop we make is a chance for our troopers to educate motorists on safe driving habits. We are committed to reducing unsafe driving behaviors on all of Ohio's roadways, including the more than 225 miles that make up the Interstate 70. And I believe them. Sure. So they're looking for people that are speeding, you know, texting, uh, people that are not uh, moving over for emergency vehicles. I mean, there are dash cam videos just like this one from the Ohio uh, State Patrol where, you know, they get hit on the side of the road. And so I understand why these things are important to let people know. But while they're educating your ass, they're definitely giving you a citation as well so remember this mother truckers uh, this uh six state trooper project uh basically started right at uh right at midnight uh so i'm sorry i didn't wake up early enough to give you this information if you were driving at night and got a ticket but uh it's all the way till a sunday afternoon okay so here's the thing people uh just know that these people have the highest tech possible you know uh ohio brags about their new airplane tech that they have that i'll show you guys right here highways before now troopers used a stopwatch and markings on the highway with this they can clock speed and record your car on video watch how a crew in the air tells troopers on the ground which cars to pull over left lane number four come up three two by left lane number one ahead is your target. Right number one in front of you. Indiana, they have semi truck highway patrol people that are going to be monitoring and just looking to make sure that you're not speeding. It's not what you'd expect to see state police climb into heading out on patrol, but not seeing them is exactly why they are turning to big rigs to help crack down on distracted driving. It was amazing how many people are actually texting and driving. Um, holding their cell phone in their hand. Well, it's extremely effective. Uh, when the police aren't, when, when the motoring public believes that the police is not paying attention or aren't present, you get to see a lot of the aggressive driving. You'll see drivers uh, passing on the shoulder. You'll see the texting and uh, cell phone use. From their higher vantage point, troopers are able to spot distracted drivers. Texting right here, the black one, black. Of course, the normal highway patrol cars. So they're all over the place, okay, people? Just don't worry, be professional, drive like you are. But Ohio, Pennsylvania, and Indiana are already saying they're gonna go heavy, heavy on the I-70. So just know that if you're on the I-70, going through that direction, uh, the chance of you getting stopped, very likely. We all know it's the beginning of the month. Uh, these states gotta make their quota and make their money. And you know, uh, comment down below, mother truckers. Let me know if you're on the I-70, if you're in Ohio, Pennsylvania, or Indiana. They said they were gonna be heavy with bears. Tell me if that's true or not. Comment down below, let me know about that. And also, you know, they spend so much money on these projects uh, using airplanes, new tech, uh, so many officers. Uh, do you think that that's best for the taxpayers' money. You know, um, I always have my feelings about that, but comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about that as well. Have a great day. Be safe out there. I know you guys are already doing the right thing, but today, hey, 
be a little bit more prepared. Talk to you soon.